by not getting into good shape. It means that defenders can bunch up and really get on defenders. Here he is again. It's Chaboyev that got the wheels. Here's the chase. And he scores Abby around him. What a run. He's been the class act of the half anyway. And Tom Chaboyevic for the length of the field run. Beautiful. <laughs> Referee checking with his touch judges and says that's all right. Try number two. Took a while to come. 35 minutes in. Wow. Chaboyevic. How fast is he? I would have liked to see that race go on for a little bit longer. But it didn't even look like a contest. Didn't even look close as he just cruised across that line to score an easy try for this manly side. It went pretty much 100 metres there. Nice little short place. The inside ball that's caused havoc all day. No room to move there whatsoever. Lafaele, poor attack, but Abby just got left further and further behind as this man Owen just scored with such fine pace. Well, they were having some joy through that middle uh, with that inside ball. The Warriors had an opportunity to score points down the other end, only tackles before. And then Manly, well, they switched from defence to attack perfectly. The Warriors again, lazy and slack in the middle third. And they're certainly being made to pay there. Continues to impress with his... 13 carries for 87 metres, plus 24 tackles night. No wonder he's in the New South Wales 20s. And another opportunity. Here he comes again. Double trouble and double quick time. And it's Trevojevic under the posts. Well, we spoke about how good this man inside looks. The spines, the opportunity taking they take. The big players, Trevojevic and that man, Dimitriou. Probably a build of Owen Craig if we go back... Uh, many years ago, that centre type build. But geez, he's got great footwork. Hard to tackle, not much of a target area there. He's not long and lanky. But this kid, when he's out there showing his pace and speed, he's just cruising. Nice change of angle. Dimitri, ball change. Bumps off one, goes through Bunty R4, who's been great in defence all day. This kid looms up once again, Trebojevic. Wonder how fast he really is, Owen. Yeah, look, they're, they're a very good footy side, Manly. They started the season with six or seven wins on the trot, and Trebojevic was a, was a big key to that. Then he pushed up to first grade. It was no coincidence that they, they dropped a few games and, and slid down the table. But with him back in the side, they certainly have some confidence. And right across the park, they've got some threat. Aaron Clark does well. BT on the inside for Abby. The ball's gone forward. Here he is again. Here's the danger man. He's got plenty of pace. And Tommy Trebojevic is away again. This is try number three. What a run. What a player. Wow. That's the fastest player I've seen this year by any grade live. Trebojevic ran with ease, with pace with no even thought of being tackled. He knew he was in for a try, Owen, to have that pace, an amazing feeling. Yeah, look, outstanding. I actually saw him coming out at half-time, or after half-time. He's a big lad, real tall, strapping bloke. He's certainly got a big career ahead of him. But again, the Warriors come up with an area, and straight on the back of that, manly pounce. This young kid, certainly a joy to watch, and, and he's, he's going to go places. He's, he's got a big future ahead of him, already playing first grade. He was... Talk to, to maybe play first grade today if Cherry Evans wasn't there. But uh, certainly doing a job for this under-20 side. Well, Cherry Evans contributed greatly to the under-20s when he was back in that division as well. I think he might still be the highest point scorer, actually, for the Manly uh, under-20s. But this kid, uh, many regarding as the heir apparent to Brett Stewart, a couple of classy acts here today. I've been really impressed by Hines as well as Adam again. Gee, he's been good. Here we go. Oh, Tommy. He's back with it again. He's got the dummy. And Tommy Trebojevic, you are too much, my man. He's in the score again. Wow. That's all I have to say. Well, short, precise, but to the point, because this kid is amazing, and I think he's going to hit 500 metres today. I really do think he's going to get there. 370 metres again. Four tries, Owen Gooden. But what more can this kid do? Oh, stop it. He's just too good, isn't he? It's just pretty to watch. He's having fun out there. Just He glides across the field. and Look at the support play. Again, poor defence from the Warriors. One out, trying to force the situation. And then once the ball gets in his hands, he weighs up the situation, puts it in two hands, throws the dummy, and then just pins his ears back. It's, it really is pretty. Well, I tell you what, you know, we are, well, we're just witnessing a real class act and the emergence of a talent we can enjoy maybe for a decade to come. Speaking with our 
Lovely cameraman up here, Gus, too. He's a legend in rugby league coverage in New Zealand and on Sky Sport, Gus. He leans over, says, gee, he looks like Brett Mullins, doesn't he, from Canberra?